I'm Jess Dupont, I'm 17. I moved to the island 11 years ago and I started writing poetry in third and fourth grade. My show now is called Puzzle Pieces and I named it that because it's kind of like a compilation of all different parts of my life that I've written about and together they kind of form what I'm sharing as the whole story and so um, that's what's on exhibit today. Jess Dupont came to me as kind of a recommendation from two of her teachers, from her writing teacher and then also her art teacher. So um, it's also coming up right after all of the Martha Sabina Regional High School shows up in the main gallery. So I thought it would be a great time for the charter school to be really well represented by this fantastic artist. I write mostly um, for myself. I write to kind of keep track of how I'm feeling and what I'm doing and kind of make sense of what's going on within me. And so exhibiting it like this is, is definitely hard in a way because it's so personal. This is all part of a portfolio that I'm doing for the charter school as part of my um, senior requirements. And I think dis not so much writing and having them on display, but making them was the hardest part because I identify with myself as being creative but not artistic. And so it was kind of a challenge to push myself to go beyond what I expected from myself and what I thought people were going to expect from me for having a show at Featherstone and try to make it as creative and visually appealing as possible. <coughs> it's a tracing of my body and I, it's really personal and I kind of wrote it um, so that it didn't advertise a specific event, but it's really true to myself, and I think that's the one I'm most proud of. I was expecting something, I guess, a little bit different, and was very pleasantly surprised with how she really uses kind of more of like word art. So there's lots of text involved and a lot less kind of figurative um, imagery, and so it's, it's nice to see writing as art, for sure. I think it's really important that Featherstone inspires the next generation of artists. We have, in the background, you can hear some of our children, our younger children, who are here at, at uh, art class, the three to six-year-olds, and here we're sponsoring a wonderful senior at the Charter High School, and we hope, after she finishes at college, that she'll come back and show her art again. I'm really excited. I never thought that I would exhibit in, in a place like this, and um, so, it's a really big step for me and I'm, I'm very proud of it and it's exciting. <laughs> when I see the high school kids or, or young adults, all ages, and just uh, people exploring, it's just, it's exciting to me to, and I feel a bit the best about what I'm doing. Anything that we can do to help support artists, to help support students in terms of how they create their art and presenting their art and showing their art is really important to us. That's what the mission of Featherstone is all about, supporting artists of all ages. Because this is Featherstone's 15th anniversary, we picked 15 artists that are new to Featherstone that bring an amazing new community to Featherstone through their work. So this series of 15 shows throughout the summer, starting now in April and going all the way through the very end of September are in the Pebble Gallery, which is just down the hill from Featherstone. And we have the entire lineup up on our website at featherstoneart.org.